What is going on you guys? It is Zipper here today bringing you a tutorial on scope zooming effect I guess. I'm not sure what it's called. But um, it's going to be this, oh the effect's going to pop up on the screen now. And yeah that's what we're learning today. Um, I don't know if you saw that but yeah it's just that kind of scope thing I did in that um, edit just there. But, um, yeah, let's get straight into it. So, if I've still got the OCC clip, try find it. I think I went past it like twice, didn't I? OCC, Jesus, I'm so blind. Um, so, we'll just do this quickly. Um, oh, Jesus. So, I did it around, I did it here I think, yeah. So, as soon as he zooms in, sh con Command Shift D for Mac, Control Shift D for Windows, go until he kind of zooms out a lot, like not straight away but a lot, after I guess, I don't know how to put it. But um, yeah, so what I do is I would um, duplicate it, so command D and get your um, ellipse tool click command shift to, hold, to get it in the center and hopefully it shows the quality a lot better otherwise I was going to have to take a while stab in the dark I think I got it perfect, <laughs> okay fair enough um, so what I do is I would freeze frame right here go to the bottom one freeze frame the yeah free blah, blah, blah. freeze frame this one as well They're both at the exact same time but with this one push s on the bottom one and zoom all the way up until you can't see any black bits so it probably looks shitty now this looks shitty as well so what you want to do go into your mask feather it out a little it doesn't look as bad, it looks kind of better. Um, with. Um, so you can use this, or you don't have to, or you can if you want, it doesn't matter. Um, but I pr prefer the backing. But, um, so what effect you want to put on it is CC camera, or is it just camera? Camera. Camera, yeah, camera lens blur on the bottom one, so your background. Put it to about 6, in between 4 and 8 is what you should go, so I'll just do 6 for this one. Um, so you're done with the background. You're done with the background. Um, with this, push I so you go to the start of the clip. S, scale. So this is just what I do. You can do this effect any way you want, but what I do is I'll keyframe at 100, go close to the end I guess, zoom all the way down to about, I don't know, 25, that's what I usually go to, 25, push O so I can go to the um, end of the clip and go back to 100, and then um, highlight all of these, um, F9, graph editor, uh, F9 to put it into easy ease and then go to graph editor zoom in kind of and then drag these all the way down like this so it gives it more of that flowing effect and I also do this so shift R so you can pull up rotation um, keyframe there go to where it reaches its um, peak at 25% um, scale. Go to, uh, I don't usually put in a number, I just twist it so it's about maybe 90. Yeah, I go about 90, 90 degrees. And then I put zero on the way back. So it looks, I don't know, it looks a lot, I don't know, it looks good in edits with Twixter and shit. Um, it looks good with Twixter. You gotta, what you do though is um, 
So say you're syncing up feeds, um, there'll be a, um, a base here, so say there's a base here, a base here, and then a base here, oh Jesus, and then a base here, or beat, whatever you want to call it. Um, so at the when it hits the beat, you want it to zoom out, and then when it hits the next beat, you want it to hit the um, sh shot. So it looks kind of, I know, it looks really synced and all that type of stuff. It's, you're not going to really see it now. Um, but yeah, that's, this, that's the effect I did for, um, the, I think I forgot, Albatraz, or I don't know how to pronounce it, but yeah, that song, that, this is the exact thing I did for Albatraz. Um, and yeah, that's pretty much it for today, guys. It's a quick little, not quick, but about six minute tutorial. Um, yeah, um, put what tutorials you want me to do in the description below, or not in the link below, um, or even in the comments, up to you guys. Um, but yeah, thanks for the support. I've been gaining a fair bit of subs and followers on YouTube and Twitter, so yeah, thanks Abe, for that. Um, yeah, it's. Bane Zipper, and I'm out. Peace.